This ad is by the Super PAC for one of the largest environmental groups in the country, the League of Conservation Voters. The group has named incumbent Congressman Mike Kaufman one of its top targets this year. Mike Kaufman took over $800,000 from polluters. That's misleading. By polluters, the ad is referring to anyone or any business that has anything to do with oil and gas over the last decade. The ad claims they got special favors from Kaufman. And voted to let them spew dangerous toxins into our air and water. That's spin. The group behind the ad is cherry-picking votes, like Kaufman's opposition to the clean power plan, tougher ozone standards, and efforts to fight climate change, like a carbon tax. Kaufman's campaign points to other votes, to reauthorize the Land and Water Conservation Fund, research the social impact of carbon pollution, and enforce the Obama-era methane rule although he has flip-flopped on that. He was also named Wind Champion of the Year this year by the American Wind Energy Association. The ad claims Kaufman's votes have jeopardized our health. Which could lead to more cancer, asthma, and heart and lung disease. That's debatable. The EPA under President Trump said repealing the clean power plan could lead to as many as 1,400 premature deaths a year due to heart and lung disease. But other analysis shows the U.S. is on track to meet the carbon reduction goals regardless of whether the plan is repealed. Bottom line, environmentalists have not been able to move the needle much when it comes to their climate message. So they've tweaked it. Expect to hear a lot about clean air and clean water this election. After all, who doesn't want that? Mike Kaufman? His environmental record isn't perfect, but it isn't as bad as they suggest either. I'm Sean Boyd. That's Reality Check.